to learn how to do import in MongoDB. So in the last lecture, what we did was uh, we have exported the uh, data and uh, which was lying in our Mongo home. In this video, we will try to import the same. So you can um, get the command uh, from the blog, from my blog, frameassume.com and you can try it or you can go to um, MongoDB documentation. So again, please note and remember that you are not supposed to type this command in the mongo console like here if you do mongo import it would fail it won't even recognize what what is this because it's not the mongo uh, mongo is basically it runs on javascript functions so this is not a javascript function this is a pure executable file which is part of the mongo installer so uh, now what we are going to do is we will say mongo and see uh, by doing the tab you will see what are the other command uh, available so you have mongo d mongo dump mongo export mongo files mongoose mong start and there are mongo top to see the performance and bunch of other stuff but we will just focus on the most usable and practical stuff so we will go with mongo import after that it takes parameter which database you want to import so this is not necessary that uh, the database you have exported uh, import should be same name so we have exported it from pcat but we can uh, you know import it into pdog so let's name it as pdog so pdog is a uh, database name and collection name uh, can be different anything the parent collection was probably products over here instead of products i can say as items when i am trying to import it right so these are the two uh, main uh, database and the collection name two main parameters and then uh, you can optionally give it the type and there are some uh, other stuff but you have to give the file so now we will try to give the hyphen hyphen file and that's how whatever file you want uh, uh, import whatever the what because sometimes people gets confused with and they import some file and it takes time in debugging so i usually segregate the date so i know which date i need to import so it reduces confusion that's how mongo import database name collection name and then file name. and that's all what you need to do a uh, import so it is uh, json decoder is out of sync seems like to changing because it was the json array before we created as as form of json array so either we can uh, uh, make those changes and uh, uh, you know tell this guy that it's a json array or we can just do the export normal and can do the import uh, just straight forward in a normal way we'll just first try that out so we did a export which will overwrite and then we will do the import like this so it has imported over here because this time when we imported it was just bunch of uh, uh, documents separated by new line character which mongo understands by default we exported in that way and same way we have imported it there are a lot of options of exporting uh, using uh, json array or you can uh, get it as csv format which is comma separated value format so that it looks neat in the uh, excel sheet and a uh, bunch of stuff is available feel free and try that stuff for uh, exploring importing it and then uh, exporting it so i hope this helps and uh, for uh, more details watch uh, you know or read through the blog frameassume.com uh, thanks